Lynn, it's Freya Sky here. And please remember, if you like my song, please vote for the UK. Every vote counts. Mwah. Incredible performances, world-class vocals, questionable fashion choices. Yes, we all love a bit of Eurovision. But move over, Sam Ryder. Did you know there's also a junior Eurovision Song Contest? And this year, the UK is entering for the first time in 16 years. How exciting! So, on December 11th, 13 year old Freya Sky is going to try and bring it home for the UK with her song Lose My Head. Go on, Freya! So, to get you ready for the big day, here's a countdown of the top five things you need to know about Junior Eurovision. At five, where it all began. The biggest kids' song contest on Earth and possibly the universe was born way back in 2003. Now, at last, the UK has decided to rejoin the party. Let's hope good things come to those who wait. At four, which countries compete? This year, 16 countries have entered and on behalf of the UK, Freya will be travelling all the way to Armenia, which is here, but you knew that. Yeah, the 20th Junior Eurovision Song Contest will take place in Yerevan, Armenia, because Belena was last year's winner. What an absolute bop. At three, them's the rules. Here's the lowdown on the golden rules of Junior Eurovision. Singers have to be aged between 9 and 14 years old. You're allowed up to six performers to dazzle on the Junior Eurovision stage. Your song has to be brand new and under three minutes long. You must sing most of your song in your own language. Strictly no pets are allowed on stage. Sos about that hacker. Each contestant gets to live their best life as a pop star, record their song in an actual recording studio, and on top of all that, they get to film their very own music video. We're bringing dreams to life here, people. At two, time to party. The contest is live at 3 p.m. on Sunday, 11th of December. Put it in your diary. Why not crack out the bunting and flags and throw a junior Eurovision-themed party for you and your mates? And while you're at it, wow them with some top facts like... Poland was the first country to win the junior Eurovision twice in a row. Georgia has won the most times with a record three trophies in total. And Armenia have never been placed outside the top ten. And at number one, how to vote. The huge difference with the main Eurovision contest is that you can, repeat, can vote for the UK's entry. From 7pm on the 9th of December, you can vote online at jesc.tv by logging in via your BBC account. Remember to create a BBC account beforehand if you haven't already. All the details will be on the CBBC website. By the way, vote for Freya! The country with the most points will raise the famous Junior Eurovision Trophy. Could 2022 be the year that the UK brings it home? Because we're rejoining the party, people. Remember to join me, Lauren Layfield and Harvey for a Junior Eurovision party on Sunday, 11th of December. You can watch along on BBC One and CBBC, as well as BBC iPlayer. Let's give it up for Freya and Team UK and wish them all of the best. Junior Eurovision 2022, here we come. It's Freya Sky here. I'm right now backstage at CBBC Saturday Mashup and I wanted to quickly come here to say please remember if you like my song, please vote for the UK. Thank you for all of your support so far. Mwah.